Hello and welcome to this video from Joomla Shack. I'm going to show you how to set up a learning management system on your Joomla site using OS Campus, which is a Joomla component. It is the same component that we use to power all the video training at Joomla Shack and also the official Joomla.org training at training.joomla.org. So it's really robust and OS Campus is used by thousands of people each week. It is very focused on online training. So it's really good if your material is in video format or PDFs or spreadsheets or slideshows. And OS Campus provides you with the framework to host the classes in. You will also need a plugin to host your media. For example, if your media for the classes is on YouTube, you can grab an extension such as OS YouTube which will automatically pull in the YouTube videos. Or for example, if your material is on Google Drive, you can grab an extension such as OS Embed, which allows you to easily embed information from Google Drive. But you can also install plugins like this from any other Joomla developer. So OS Campus is the basis of what we're gonna look at to set up our Joomla LMS. After you've installed it, on your Joomla site, you'll go to Components and OS Campus Pro. And this is the screen you'll see in front of you. The main steps you're going to need to take are on the left-hand side, classes, lessons, pathways, tags, and teachers. And I'll take you through a quick example of each. The first thing I'm gonna do is set myself up as a teacher so that I can be marked as the teacher of the class that I'm going to create in a minute. So I'll click on Teachers. I'll click on New. And I'll link my account to a user. This is a great teacher. I can add some extra personal information if I want to. Save and close. OK. And now we have a teacher set up. Next are the pathways. The pathways are the really broad topics. If you're using OS Campus for a university, your pathways might be history, science, engineering, business. They are the very broad topics that might fit dozens or hundreds of classes inside them. So we're setting up a basic little site about Joomla here. So our pathways might be very broad topics, such as intro classes for beginners, another pathway could be extension development. And this is a very different set of topics because you need PHP skills for these classes. And also you could have some template development classes. And again, very different set of skills for very different people. You need CSS for these classes. So the pathways are a good place to start. They'll help you organize your content in your mind. The pathways are super broad and may contain many, many different classes. So we're building a little site for Joomla users, for Joomla training. We have our broad pathways set up. My next step is going to be to create the first class. I'll go to classes. Click on new, and this class will be the Beginner's Guide to Joomla. This might be the first class that people see when they access this learning management system. And let me take a look at the Pathways on option. Okay, this is definitely going to be in the intro classes if I want to. I can set the length of the class. This might be 54 for 54 minutes. The minutes will be added automatically. 
difficulty. Okay, this is definitely beginner. And the description, this is for people who are 100% new to Joomla. Okay, you can see across the top, there are some other options such as lessons and files, but we haven't added those in yet. The lessons we're going to do in a minute and the files is where you can upload any images or documents that need to be attached to the class so that people can take the class successfully. Save and close. And now we have our first class, the Beginner's Guide to Joomla, and it's in one of our much broader pathways called Intro Classes. Next, it's time to add some lessons. Okay, these lessons are all going to go into the new class that we just created. Now, where am I gonna get any videos for people who are new to Joomla? Ah, we have a YouTube channel. There is a Joomla Shack YouTube channel where I can go and grab some videos and put them in this sample class of ours. So that's what I'm gonna use. This is going to be a YouTube focused class. And if I click the new button, this will be the first video in the class. It's going to go into the class we created a few moments ago. The module is going to be a little subgroup inside the class. If the class is not long enough, then you can always enter something a little more generic, such as videos. When it comes to the lesson type, you, this could be a quiz. It could be a video on wistia.com or Vimeo, or it could just be a URL embed. And that's the option we're going to choose here. For the access level, I'm going to make these videos publicly available. Click on save, and then it's going to ask us for the URL of our video, which is going to go in here. Let me grab one of the videos from the Joomla Shack channel. And I'm going to put that inside the URL. At this point, you can save this lesson and you can go and create a second lesson. I'm going to repeat exactly the same process. This time it'll be the second lesson in the class. It's going to be in the class we created. It's going to be the lesson type URL embed. It's going to be set to public again. And I'm going to choose another Joomla Shack video. And if I click on save and put the video URL into the content tab there, I should be good to go. Click on save and close. And there we have the first and the second item in this particular class. The next step is to make it publicly visible to people. I'm going to go to menus, main menu, add new menu item. And this is going to be my OS campus menu link, call it OS campus class. The menu item type is going to be OS campus. And I'm going to link to a pathway to make it easy to find. I'm going to choose intro classes because I know my beginner class is in there. Click save. Visit the front of the site and OS Campus is over there on the right hand side. There is the beginner's guide to Joomla. I can click on this button. I should be taken to the start of the first video in the class. If I click on the actual name of the class, I'll see an overview a pretty basic overview at the moment, but an overview nonetheless. I'll see the very brief description I created of the class. I'll see the very basic information about the teacher, but I will know that my OS campus is set up and ready to go. And I can go back into my Joomla admin. I can add more lessons to this class. 
I can improve the description. I can add more information about the teacher. I can change this image. And I can also add a lot more classes and pathways as well. If you are thinking about building a learning management system on your Joomla site, check out OS Campus. For someone that wants an online class with videos and embedded content and some quizzes to prove that people have actually taken and understood the class, then I highly recommend OS Campus. We've only managed to touch the surface of what OS Campus can do, but head over to Joomla Shack, check out OS Campus. You'll find a lot of documentation in the right sidebar. And I wish you all the best with building your learning management system in Joomla.